good? No. Good? So another close game for you guys. This one you, you come out on top of. How much does the experience of being in a close game help with the players and their nerves and, and you and the rest of the staff and their nerves and being able to navigate through that? Yeah, I think it actually did help. I thought to myself, well, we've been here before. Could lose it, could win it. What It is what it is at this point. I just, I just thought that um, we had more composure because in shoot around today, we went over uh, last second place just because we've been the last two games we've had last second place. So we thought, let's rehash this, make sure we're ready to go. And it did pay off. Talk about that last play when you went to play Ivy. Was that set for Ivy or was that just how the play went? It was set for Ivy. It wasn't exactly how we had drawn it, but um, Ivy stepped up, really carried our team in pretty much the whole fourth quarter. Um, we've been looking for offense from her. She knows she can provide that, and I thought today she really did do that for us. She did it right from the beginning, too. I mean, is that a sit down talk after there, or is it in front of the whole team, like Ivy and Both. Both. Um, but as you can tell, I'm a pretty direct coach. So it's in front of the whole team, too, because I just want everyone to be on the same page. You know, I just. At this point, you shouldn't see that your, your role is pressure. It's just that's your role in the team, and you got to step up and fill that, that void. Well, I'm going to talk about the first half, 16 points, and that has been a, a challenge. Seven, you know, they're scoring 71 on you in the league, 16 points. What were some of the changes to be you know, the focus of the half? Uh, changes we made from the first half to the second half? Yeah. Um, Really, we just focused on guarding the three-point line, sitting in a stance, looking to take charges. I'm really proud of Kayla Henning for taking those charges. Um, again, I don't know what it takes to get a fouls inside. We're learning that it's some finesse that we got to figure out. But uh, I just thought we did a great job of looking to take offensives, and we had those. I'm still looking to try to score in trans transition. I thought that running sets really was effective for us today, just a little more poise uh, and just control with our pace. Um, but as you can see, when we put our freshmen in, we like to run. You know, I think Lau uh, knows she was really looking to push the ball, and I do want that. We had a lot of turnovers pile up at that point. But again, she wants to run. She's pushing up to the wings. I need the wings to be ready to shoot the ball. I want to think so, yes, I hope so. Um, again, we're just dealing with a little bit of inconsistency overall, but I think, yes, it's a huge step for us in the growth process. Yeah. All right, thanks. Thank you. Yeah.